that. Um, that you, do you sell? Are you selling your puppies too? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, we sell pups. We sell pups. Three pups are already sold out of the next litter, which will be here sooner than we expected. <laughs> Yeah, how much are your pups? So they're for anywhere from three to five thousand um, dollars, and that's three thousand on the pet home, and then could go up to five. But I'll be honest with you and saying, look, uh, like I said, three of them bookers is gone already, and then somebody trying to send me some more. I said, no, I gotta make sure we have at least some so I can pick one. <laughs> exactly, I feel, I feel you understand. Uh, but we have two litters planned, and what, you know. What, you, what kind of bullies do you have? So these will all be XLs. All of them XLs, you got XL bullies. Yeah, well, we had a a, a, a litter of smaller ones. <laughs> but we these next two litters planned are definitely going to be on the XL side. That's that's easy, 100, easy for the males, right? Yeah, yeah. Like I said, the first pick male, he's already gone. Second pick female and third pick female, they're gone already. Um, I don't know. You know, you can't predict. But, you know, as I tell people, especially in this space, um, people are inviting a new person into their home and that's a 10 plus year commitment especially if it's coming from me that joke is gonna be around so so you know just be mindful whether it's me or anybody that you get something that you can kind of like manage if you would over the next 10 years uh, but the boys oh, yeah, yeah but the boys my here. boys on the XL side would be anywhere from probably like 85 to 100 max maybe man we don't really right, go by the right, weight right. thing that's I go by good with that. that's a man stopper that's all <laughs> That's a good that's way to. A stopper, that's yeah. a that's a good way to put it. That's exactly right. Eighty pounds or or shake ego. My boy ego ran up on you. He's gonna uh, he gonna make you you break break your back if you move the wrong way. <laughs> yeah, he gonna do something to you. Right. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna tell you what, man. My name Anthony. And by the way, I'm from Cincinnati, Ohio. Oh man, how you doing? I'm Trevor, man. I don't think I ever put my real name out there. Oh, <laughs> uh, hey, uh, where are you at? So we're we're I'm in Dallas, Texas. Even though this is a Kansas number, you calling on? <laughs> Okay. Um, how much you think it costs? The, the, how do you ship the pups? Do you ship, do you ship them through uh, mobile or on the plane? No, I normally uh, we do either flight nanny, which means I personally bring them to you, or somebody associated with our uh, kennel does. So we don't do. We've not shipped under or over. We just literally, long as the dog's not over 22 pounds before it leaves, um, it, it's the flight is all it costs you, and we just bring the dog to you, man. Okay. Um. How much do you think that will cost me? Cost you bring the dog to me? Uh, whatever that flight is, uh, I just took a dog to Atlanta two weeks ago, and uh, it was literally just my ticket. And I got in there, it was like not even an hour and a half layover. Dropped the dog, dipped out, and this was uh, a, a young man's mother who was actually flying back to Tallahassee. So she scheduled me in between her her flights to because uh, she was visiting her sister. So it just depends, man, on when you get the flight and then. You know, somebody, let's say you bought, you, you put a deposit down, the pup come January 1st. From January 1st, because you already know you're getting whatever pup, I tell people like anything, book them tickets early. And then kind of go from there. That Because, you know, the sooner you get it, the less expensive it is. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, uh, let me see, let me see what I said to ask you. What kind of guarantees you got? Uh, there are no guarantees in this life, my friend. <laughs> so uh, with that health guarantee people provide, that's a lie. I'm not God. I'd be like me telling you the dog ain't gonna get cancer. It's like, how good are you with dogs? Is the real question. So I, I, I personally right, don't. I'm saying. Yeah. With, um, <laughs> so they're gonna be. I'm, what I'm, what I'm asking you basically is, is he gonna be healthy with two balls and two <laughs> testicles and all that shit? So you by know? the time, by the I time the dogs you. leave, you know our doctors do their their good check, and so you will know if the dog is cryptorchid by eight weeks. And she'll she'll she checks all that. And Cryptorchid is what you're asking. Um, but yeah, yeah. I mean, I wouldn't sell a, a reject dog. I'd put it. We put uh, one in home. You, you do the ears too, right? That's an extra cost, but yeah. But my ear guy, he charges anywhere from about two fifty to three. And I'll tell you this: the biggest dog, and he charges by the drug to be clear, and that's what it is. So the biggest dog I've had to get the ears done, he was about thirty three pounds, and that's a big old boy. Uh, and that was two ninety. So on average, it's anywhere from two twenty to like. 250 maybe 270 tops um and you know we'll get those ear done right at about seven and eight weeks as well okay okay oh uh, and they all come and they do they usually all be uh like uh what is that buck skin <laughs> <laughs> <See that color? laughs> no man uh this this litter will be more try and like try blue type stuff like it'll be more tries in this particular litter because really? the dad 
Yeah, the dad will be okay. lilac. That that buckskin that everybody's liking, my boy Bam Bam, he's a one in a million, which is why uh, I got him. <laughs> Actually, actually, I just looked at you was eating the puppies. Oh, yeah, yeah. And the chicken. And I've seen a lot of tan and tan and black masks. That's why I was asking. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. They Well, those were those were primarily blues, and there was some, like, a cream girl, and then, like, a lilac and tan, and then there's just one, one like, buckskin, bam, bam. But other than that, um, this one, you know, it's kind of one of those luck of the draws. You just never know until you know, but I'm 100% sure over 33% of the litter will be all tries. And, and and papers, everything good, right? ABKC registered, yes. Okay, man. Appreciate you so much, man. Trevor, you said Trevor, right? Yes, sir. I'm going to be calling you back. I'm going to give you some time and let me get to this, this freaking holiday, man. Yeah. Um, and I'm going to call you back. How much are the deposits? A thousand dollars. Okay. Okay. And and if I if I if I get you on your new litter, whatever litter I need you. And I just want to get a, a first pick mail. How much would that be like? Uh, so a first, whatever, 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 whatever it would just be, it'd be, it'd be five, man. It'd be five. Four, two ways I work right now is first come, first serve. I'm not trying to rob nobody. As I said, I don't know how much you've seen on the page. We've got five years of work to do. And uh, I'm in disagreements with all the things that have been done. So it'd be unrealistic, even though I have, we'll just say the brand ability to tax for the dogs. To, for me to sell something outrageous so i think the dogs are worth at least five even if we're talking about a first pick the merles to be clear they're always going to be sold for a little bit more but that's still upwards of seven thousand most and i know because okay. we've, we've already what sold that so are you going to are you going to do pet home are you huh? are you going pet home or are you going breeding i don't know if i want to breed him or not but I want to make him look, I want him to look good enough where he can if he do, if I do breed him. If I say, well, man, I want you to get me a girl if I later on, you know what I mean? But I want him to be a showstopper. I want somebody to be like, dude, where did you get this dog from? Well, that's every one of my dogs, man. Uh, but uh, <laughs> I want to be big, like, wide. I'm a big dude. I'm like 6'2". <laughs> like, I'm a big dude. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like you. Yeah, no, I know. I know, I know, I know. I'm not no small person. That's why I can't have no chihuahuas running around me. No disrespect. <laughs> no disrespect to the chihuahua lovers, but uh, I would say so three three thousand is our pet home I only. Four thousand is what I let go for. Uh, and to be clear, on the paperwork that I'll give you, which is a registration form, there's a circle. You circle pet home or breeding rights. And for pet home, that means if you can never register dogs litters moving forward so 4k is the best i could do in that regard plus i mean uh, and it's just because i mean we do too much work man to, to do anything less 3k though that's 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 pet home so you was like hey i'm just gonna love this dog i'm never gonna breed him 3k that option right there it goes straight to your house and you love and take care of it and i'm thanking god that it didn't go to a breeder to be clear so um, um so for 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 me is to give me a, a, a breeding yeah nice yeah 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 Okay, okay, I just want to make sure. Yeah. I'm going to be calling you back. I'm going to lock you in, bro. Okay. And thank you so much, man. I've been watching you. I watch you just about every day, bro. I appreciate so, it. Yeah. I appreciate it, man. I'm here to help. You got any questions, just hit my line, boss. All right, thank you, man. All right, man, Bye. peace. I tell you, people, this happens all day. This happens all day. We were shooting, and then in the middle, I'm like, phone ringing. I tell people, you go to Instagram, hit that call button, it comes straight to me. Most of the time, they take it back. Like, one dude called the other day, they go, oh, man, this is really you. <laughs> I was like, what, what can I do for you, man? Man, I ain't even expect nobody to call, man. Like, nobody, I didn't think nobody was going to pick up. I was thinking, this is a dummy number. I said, well, you know, I'm not a dummy. What can I do for you? <laughs> He was like, man, I just got these dogs over here. I'm trying to take care of, man. You didn't inspire me to do something. So he just wanted to talk. He really wanted to, he just wanted to do it if it worked. I wanted this to work real quick. Oh, man. <laughs> it's so funny, man. And mind you people, I'm just human. I'm not anything special. I do take care of my dogs at a very high level. And I teach people how to do the same. But we're literally having a blast here. And we're going to get back to this plan in a second. So stay tuned. Take care of your dogs.